Hey, by now you should know that if you're hungry, even after you have just eaten six gohyeong and two plates of bihun, it's Gregon telling you that you're hungry. But luckily, you got a bit baggy like me, so they can create enough gretan, right, to tell a stupid break. Uh, 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 you didn't know that. Then maybe this influencer is surprised at how you live your life, yeah. And her surprise uh, has gone viral. Here's everything you need to know about this Singapore influencer's viral story. I'll simplify for you. Don't just see if you still think that losing weight is all about exercising and not eating less gohyeong, you idiot. So, so, uh, so, this Singapore influencer uh, has over 136k followers in TikTok. And because she's so busy, uh, she sometimes do a video uh, while getting ready to go out. Uh. Just like you know, a guy who's so busy that he has to give tips right, while sitting in a bad way. Recently, uh, she went on a rant uh, while doing her makeup. Uh. She wondered uh, how people can live uh, without knowing basic science. How can you like live your life not knowing how your body works? And wonder uh, how their conversation is like. I want to know how those conversations are going because for me, it's so strange. She then used an example uh, like talking to a friend uh, who didn't know what class like, coach order is. But I have this other friend who like don't even know what constipation is. Then as you expect, uh, the internet went crazy. Uh. They felt while uh, she's showing off. And people who study science, uh, which basically is everyone, uh, aren't like that. Damn! And she removed the video and did a follow-up video. Here, she kind of apologized. Uh. You know, I like certain tutor who apologized, but it's written by a 3-year-old PR firm by a, firm by a 3-year-old. She's kind of sincere, uh, although she's still very busy. Uh, doing her video uh, while getting ready to go out. You know, people should just start this trend, right? Maybe just call it Get Ready With Me. Whereby uh, they pretend to be busy, uh, but actually isn't. Uh, and I think we all idiots believe. Then they can call it GRWM. Uh, sounds surgical. Right? <laughs> Now, whether you believe her or not, let me tell you a true story, a true story. So that time, my house suddenly no powers, so he called an electrician, his name is Raymond. For your info, I'm an endocrinologist, and then I run my own practice in Novena. I know you all don't know what I'm talking about, just watch on UOSESK. So Uncle Raymond came, and then I told him that. I see he's so thin, uh, I wonder if he got at least some common sense of eating more, yeah. or at least if he got any issue with metabolism. Uh, uh. He then look around uh, and try to find the problem. I think uh, he's going to think uh, he's thin uh, because he moved around. Bodo, uh, no common sense. Uh. No exercise activity thermogenesis uh, does burn calories, uh, but it's based on metabolic rate right, that is most likely causing him right, to look at a chopstick. Uh. He move around, 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 and then finally uh, he found the problem. Uh. That'll be $150. Okay, here is $180. Uh, $30 for you to eat more gohyeong. Uh. So, 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 what's wrong? Electricity transporter losing insulin to the wire. Uh. You know common sense. Uh. You didn't turn on the switch. Uh. Next time, uh, try to use common sense. Uh. Hey, go MB. Bye. Yeah, so the moral of the story is very very simple. Uh. No matter whether you are high SES, low SES, or no SES, uh, common sense is different for everyone. Uh. So don't get stuck uh, in your bubble. Uh. In the meantime, uh, if you think you learn something, uh, consider subscribing. Uh. If not, you know common sense is uh, bodo.